and um, you know, it was a normal day for me. I played my baseball game, and I came home, you know, got supper, uh, and started to watch the rest of the ball game. When this guy, don't know if you guys know his name, but Scoo Jeanette, four home runs in the game. Now, he's for the Reds, okay? He's on the Reds team. So, he's the first one on the Reds to have four home runs in the game. That's, in, that's, that's incredible to know that the oldest franchise and all the way from today it takes that long for someone to have four home runs. And also, he also had a green slam with one with one of his four home runs and that's second in Moby history. This guy broke records today. Okay. And here's another one. Four home runs and ten RBI. He's the second player in M L B history to do that. And the final one, four home runs, ten RBIs and five hits. Best in, in MLB history. This guy has successfully done it. Like, this game did it. You know, he even said uh, he was going to donate all of his stuff. Like, he was going to sell all of his equipment and his jersey and stuff. He was going to put it in the uh, Red Hall of Fame because this this is not to remember. Okay, is is June six, two thousand seventeen. I mean, this guy has broke records. You know, after he has said home run, he did current call. Okay, so. Yeah, a great thing they couldn't call him. He did it. When he came up for the last time the game, the crowd was like roaring. Like it was so loud. I mean like yeah. And this guy still had a home run. And what I thought was cool about was okay caught it caught the fourth home run and that ball has to be worth thousands that that ball's worth a lot and so you know may, maybe the kid will trade it you know I've seen a lot of people do that where like if they get a good milestone or something in the game um, and they get the ball, uh, for the record, then the person usually, um, uh, the person usually trades it, and the guy who did it would usually, uh, sign a lot of stuff, and give, and they would give him free stuff or whatever. I thought that, that, I mean, just to know that someone, that a kid caught a ball that's that much worth, I mean, that's crazy. Um, yeah. And guys, if you guys go on Facebook, I bet it's probably going to be full. Like, if you're a Red fan. Probably gonna see a fool like your friends and your family. Your friends. <laughs> uh, you may want to turn off your Facebook notifications or any social media notifications, but not this. Just make sure you watch this video. So anyway, um, just want to talk on. I uh, talk on that. I mean, it's crazy. Like. This guy just 
did it tonight. You didn't care. Like, you just ripped the ball and it just went. And to know that I was sitting on the couch watching that, that's a lot to me because of the YouTube channel, you guys. Um, to know that I watched it and I could tell you guys. But, yeah, we'll see you guys later. Bye.